Okay, so today here I have two packages, both containing fingerboard wheels. This first one is from Goat on the Road FB, or Helena, and she sold me some Chems wheels, which he no longer makes, so that's pretty cool. And she sold them to me for a very good price, and they're just standard white street shape wheels. And for the second package, I have an order from Darkwood, and sadly, this order is actually they're probably one of their final orders. Darkwood was having a 50% off sale off every item in the store to get rid of their last remaining stock, and I decided to cop some pink urethane street shape wheels for my Arizona iced tea board. All right, so I'm gonna start with my order from Goat on the Road. So these are going to be the Chems wheels. The package is opening pretty janky. Oh, stickers, let's go. Make a way back there, there we go. Okay. Oh, there they are. <laughs> yeah, obviously they're used. I'm gonna clean them a little bit, but they're looking clean. No, actually they're not, they're dirty, but they're looking clean as hell. So here, as you can see, I have the Chems wheels in the pack. They are a little bit dirty because they have been used, but I got them for a very, very good price, so thank you to Helena for that. And she also included a ton of really cool stickers from a bunch of different like well-known fingerboard brands like we have DK right here, Beast Pants, Black River, Fingerboard Ruin My Life, lots of, lots of classic stuff and I'm pretty sure we have some Azzy Berlin stuff as well. So that's really really cool so huge shout out to her. Here I have the Darkwood order which should be some pink wheels. So this is the Darkwood order. We have a bunch of their signature stickers right here and then just the classic Darkwood fingerboards. I really like this one though. It's pretty simplistic, but also one of my favorites. They really taped up this bag here, so I kind of had to get it undone a little bit just for like ease of access on camera. But I'm gonna pull the wheels out here. And they're in a black bag, so you can't actually see what they look like yet. So we're just gonna have to open that. But as you can see right here, 95A pink. So let's get this open. I had to pause for a second there because there was a couple staples in this I wanted to just get out. But here are the wheels. Ooh, they're beautiful. Looking super clean. Just this nice like tan pink kind of color. Looking really good. I'd almost call it like a salmon pink. But yeah, so I'm gonna get these on a, a board real quick and then we'll test them out. I can't even remember what happened, but they literally like fully t Alright, so the Chems wheels that I've put on this deck, I want to just kind of clean them up a little bit because, you know, you just want to get your own wear on them and get them looking fresh before you start using them again. So, for those who don't know, the way that you typically do that is just by rolling it over a piece of duct tape. So, I'm just going to do that now. Looking definitely a lot better. I'm just gonna do a quick sound test of both of these wheels. So I'll start off with the dark wood pink slash salmon y kind of color 95A urethane wheels. That's what they sound like on the wood. Whew, that was a loud one. <laughs> and then on the marble. Super squeaky. And then now on the Chems wheels. And sadly, since these are discontinued, I don't really know what the hardness of them is. Here's what they sound like on the wood. And on the marble. Oh. 
Well, this is a package I've been waiting for for about under a month, probably. Eh? I think so. I think about a month now, and uh, Just about. it's it's gonna help me set up a couple boards here. Replace the trucks on this bad boy. Homemade deck, made by Orbit. You already know. And then uh, wheels for this bad boy. The board kennel setup. Got the blue wheels on it now, just China wheels, and I was gonna buy them to replace these ones. I've got some elasticals on the way for this boy, but we're gonna put them on this boy tonight. Once I open her up, so let's get into it. Woo! <laughs> Jeez! Holy you already know. Ooh, I like that sticker. Darkwood sticker. Darkwood sticker. Darkwood sticker. Darkwood fingerboards. Ooh, little, little edgy one, you know? <laughs> the artistic. Ooh, another little edgy one. I actually really like that one. That one's really nice. All right, on to the best part now. <laughs> so these are just the uh, the trucks, I'm pretty sure. Got some trucks here. Rip them bitches open. <gasps> oh, fuck. I forgot they always just loosely put all this. Ooh boy, use a manual focus. There we go. Oh yeah. Beauty. Clean. You already know. These boys are a little too short. These are hangers here. Either they leave too much space on the sides, so had to order these up. They're 34 millimeter. These ones I believe are 32 or 33. Not sure, but oh yeah, you can already see that they're gonna fit way nicer. And the part I'm most excited for. Oh they. Woo. This is actually gonna be my first ever set of urethane wheels. Oh yeah, true. I've not, I've not owned a set Joining of urethane before. Exactly. And finally, not feel like such a bum loser. Ooh. Urethane gang. Ooh. Thank you. You're gonna black. <laughs> you can't black see it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Here it is. Do, 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 do. Ooh. Yes, sir. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's gonna be sick, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Those are clean, clean. Alright, I ain't gonna waste no time. I'm about to rip these the wheels off of this bitch. Let's get it. Alrighty. Got these bad boys on. They are looking clean. My focus. There we go. Nice sort of black and white swirl there. Yeah. A bit of blue in it, right? Yeah, exactly. Nice little. Ooh. It just looks so nice. And then, will you do the kickflip first try? Shit. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> New wheels. Right, wheels. It was out of focus, so it doesn't count. Hold on, wait a sec. There we go. Now real first try. Feels so different. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> uh, real first try now. Okay. Uh, Let's go. Uh, uh, uh. Nice. Oh, that's a clean ollie. That was high <laughs> pop, bro. Not bad. Oh boy. It just feels so much better too. Like riding it yeah. on this material. It's unbelievable, so it much feels... more grippy. Well, goddamn, boys, I'm very happy, safe to say, with my dark wood fingerboards order. Thank you very much. Uh, coming all the way from Russia, too. So, understandable why it took a while to get here, but I'm happy with what I got. Very excited to throw these on my new deck as well, from my other deck. And uh, time to shred these urethanes. All right, what's up, everyone? It's Kyle, and I've got a couple really special packages that come in, and it is a new deck and a new pair of trucks, so I'm really excited because these are some really nice premium items that I'm getting for the first time. Like, um, so I've got a nice deck from Chems, which I absolutely love his graphics and um, yeah, you'll, you'll see the one I got, it's so cool. And then I also picked up some dynamic trucks because so far on all my setup I've just got China trucks. So. I was like, you know what, I might as well go big, get get some really nice quality ones, and I like the look of Dynamics better than BRTs, so I decided to go with them. So I guess let's start with the deck from Chems here. So I already slid the box, but oh, that's so cool. Oh, it even comes in its own mini box with the artwork on it. 
please just suck on the side. Also, it's a little info on the back, like the size and everything. So I got popsicle shape, mid pro mold, and uh, 34 millimeter. Oh my, that looks so good. I'll, I'll do some close-ups and just splice them in here because it might be kind of hard to see from here. But I got the dragon graphic. It's so beautiful. It's got a nice blue background with a red and black dragon with some yellow accents on it. It looks so nice. And then also on the top fly, it's got chems like engraved into it and, and even the shape. It's like mid pro 34 by 96. The holes look really good. The side has um, the plies go. Natural red, natural red, natural. And yeah, the quality just seems amazing just from holding it here. And also in this little box, you get two sheets of grip. That's nice. Usually you get one or none, so cool, two. And just got a little receipt in there, and then a few stickers. Ooh, a lot of them are reflective, that's cool. We've got a couple like graffiti logos, one of them's reflective, one of them's pink. Um, Grim Reaper, a little reflective one. Grim Reaper mouse with a cheese scythe. And then this crazy mouse. <laughs> so yeah, that's awesome. Really, really happy with with this. And yeah, let's let's move on to the dynamics. All right, here they are. So I got black and I got them 34 millimeters to go because I'm mainly going to be using them with this deck. This is going to be like my main setup from now on, uh, along with the oak wheels. Um, so yeah, those, those are looking really nice. Super clean. I love the shape of them. And they've got nice white bushings to contrast the black trucks. Looks sick. And let's see if we get any stickers or anything else. Yeah, it looks like there's a few down there. So... Nice little rainbow block letter dynamic logo. And then a little sheet with a few smaller ones, like their main logo, some bubble letters, some different text, and some more you probably can't see because they're white. But nice. Let me get these open, I guess. I like the packaging. It's, it feels like something you'd you know, get from a store with like the plastic over cardboard. It's, it feels really premium. Same with the chems, honestly, in that little sleeve. They're both, both these places have really good packaging. And there it is. Again, I'll splice in some close-ups here. So, it comes with white pivot cups in already, as well as white bushings, which are clearly far superior to the china bushings, which are just little O-rings. These are like actual shaped bushings. You got that nice screw kingpin, which, you know, allows you for easier adjustment and I think, I think it allows you to have them looser as well, which I personally like, because I find sometimes I, like I like my trucks fairly loose, and sometimes they just fall apart on the china boards because the little nuts loosen. So yeah, they're looking really nice. Let's get the rest of this open. It's a tough packaging open though. There we go. Second one also looking nice. And then we'll see what we get in the bottom. So. Okay, it just looks like the tool with some screws. Yeah, so you just get the standard black Tech Deck tool, uh, the eight screws, and the lock nuts for the wheels. So, yeah, I'll get this set up and I'll show you guys what it looks like all done. So here I have a package from Board Kennel. He's a Canadian board maker, and I have multiple decks from him already. I have the Arizona Ice Tea board, and this bottom ply is actually a piece of the can. And then I have the watermelon board, and then I have the checkered blue and pink board, and I love all of them. And this is a custom board that I got done from him just a couple of days ago. Oh, give me free trucks. Thank you. Free trucks, pink, very good. And a sheet of grip for free. 
because I was only going to order this deck essentially so yeah so we have the board kennel sticker sheets and here is the board oh it's so nice Alright, so it's a special shape, but as you can see, we have the top ply here, it's kind of a purple and yellow, and it might look more of like a black or gray on camera, but, whoa, there it is, the Orbit deck, that is extremely clean, and I'll have a, some more close-up, higher quality shots of it in a little bit. Alright, so here I have a package from Industry FB. I think it's coming from Russia, but I'm not 100% sure. It's already been kind of ripped right here because I was just taking off some shipping info. But um, I'm expecting some matching wheels for this board that I have from Board Kennel. It's just uh, pink and blue tiles, and the wheels should be pink and blue swirls, so I'm really excited to get into this. Alright. Alright, nothing else left in the package, so it's just this, it's taped up, so I'm just going to quickly skip past it. Here's the package. Ooh, okay. Alright, so to start off, we have two sets of bushings that are just extra for free, that's really nice. And they're just the, the matching pink and blue swirl, and the 70D wheels that I bought, these are going to be so nice. Oh, that's cute. Comes in a little, like, box, just kind of... Oh, there they are. Wow, those are so clean. Holy. Well, I'm just gonna throw this in as like a editor's note, I guess, because I never actually filmed a section where I like rolled the wheels and did a squeak test on them, but I assure you, they're definitely squeaky. They roll insanely clean, like probably the, the smoothest rolling wheels that I have and if I were to compare them to anything I would compare them to oak wheels they're very very similar very comparable I just say the oak wheels are a little bit more grippy but besides that I'd say they roll almost cleaner than oak wheels all right so my package from EMA ramps has finally arrived and I do say finally because sadly the shipping was a little disappointing on this package. It was only coming from Pennsylvania to Canada and I think I paid $20 US shipping which converts to like a pretty decent amount more Canadian, probably like, I don't know, 24 or 5 and it took about a month or almost a month to get here, like very close. I think it's uh, like 6 days off of a month. So yeah, that was a little disappointing but... That is fine because I'm really ready to get into this rail because I know it's going to be very good. The cutting was a little janky, but whatever. I just ordered a black rail. I forget exactly how many inches it is, but I'll list it, I'll list it in the description. But... That is clean. That's the EMA Ramps logo right here. It's a little interesting to see on camera because of the flash, but yeah, it's a very nice length. It's pretty hefty, nice material, the finish on it's basically perfect. And at the bottom, obviously, some non-slides, which is really helpful. And yeah, so, hit some clips on this and uh, put it in. Here's another quick unboxing. This is a gift from Strumel or Kyle from uh, Orbit Fingerboarding as well. And it's for my birthday, it's from Collins Wood. You can see the mushroom, really nice little stamp on the package here. It's an obstacle, so I'm just gonna get right into it. Okay, looks like he threw in some grip. Thank you very much. Nice little, oh, little message. Thank you for the sport man. Enjoy, much love. Thank you very much. Got some stickers. Sub with a skateboard, that's kinda sick. Oh, I saw this on his Instagram, this is cool. That's really cool. 
This is actually really sick. Comes in like a little carry bag and it even has this logo like stamped onto it. I think that's really awesome. Hey, and he gave me some extra stuff too. Cool crystal of sorts. Not sure what this one is. And a little chain with crystal on it. That's cool. I think this one's actually made out of resin, but... So here it is. It is a curb. Oh wow, that is so sick, holy. You kind of see the print of the bubble wrap there, but ignore that. Wow, this is so nice. Hit it, and then I'm just gonna... What's going on, guys? <laughs> Let me reset. Oh, oh, oh. Fingerboard review. Oh, I got something special. <laughs> Fingerboard review. What's going on, guys? It's your boy, Rice, from uh, Orbit FB. And today I've got something very, very special for y'all. I've been waiting for this for an unreasonably long amount of time, actually. And it's no, no fault to, you know, the owner of Alaska or anything like that. It's fully the fault of horrible Canadian shipping services. They've been bad since I was like a youth, so. But uh, today, like I said, <laughs> something very special. <laughs> In this one. <laughs> what is that from again? In this one. The long bus. Yeah, that's right, right, yeah, yeah. In this one. The long bus. <laughs> In this one. But uh. <laughs> what I have in here. Pound of weed, pound of weed. A pound of weed, pound of weed. <laughs> is it still filming yet? What I have in here are two very special sets of wheels. The complete two completes that I have. And uh, one of them being this guy right here. Beautiful UAG deck. As you can see, got the UAG trucks on it as well. Currently have dark wood wheels on it. Urethane is as well. Uh, very nice, but the elasticos in here go perfectly with it for the color. These I actually ordered for another deck completely different. And then um, the second set of wheels are going to go with this bad boy. Which, uh, there'll be a picture up on the screen now, but this is actually like an exact replica of my skateboard that I use. Um, down to even the base plates and everything, so uh, the wheels are the last piece that are going to complete it. So, without further ado, let me... Unbox this bad boy. Alright, that's, that's, yeah, ooh. Interesting package. So, let me see here. Unfortunately, I can't show you guys the front of this package, but it's actually cool. It's got a little, like, elastico style background where my shipping information and everything is. Thus, why I can't show you. But uh, the back has more shipping information, so I <laughs> will cut that part out. <laughs> and, uh, here we are. The moment I've been waiting for for two months. All right, now is the moment of truth. Three head busts in a row, but here it is. Woo! Oh, nice little little note. Is that everything? Yes, that is everything. All right, first I'm gonna read the note from Elastico. Hello, Patrick. Many thanks for the order. Elastical Wheels Street Stripe Edition. With all stuff that I made, especially the wheels improvement are the most important thing to get the best out of my own style and make the customer satisfied. I hope you enjoy and have a great ride. Cheers, Basid from, uh, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, I'm sorry if I totally botched that. Um, from Elastico, thank you so much. Very nice little note, you can see the Elastico on the background there, very nice. So Elastico, I actually got three of those ones. Elastico F Skate. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Alright, next sticker that's nice. It's got the uh, colorful elastico logo there. That one's really that one's sick actually, yeah. Earlier I ordered I ordered two sets of wheels from him and he uh, told me he threw in a free set of bushings for me. Which is really nice. Look at those nice little orange elastico bushings there. Very clean. I'm very grateful for those. So we'll start with uh, Oh my gosh. Wow, wow, wow. This is the Hold first it down a little set. lower, I'll just zoom in. First set of wheels there. <laughs> oh my goodness. They're very clean. Yes, sir. Oh my god. It looks looks like an actual pair of skateboard street wheels. And I love the packaging too. Um, if you've ever ordered a pair of Elasticos, I guess uh, there's a package 
uh, or the, on the back of the package rather, there should be a little picture of a cat fingerboarding. Very funny. These are the wheels that I was the most excited for because they will fully complete this. This is my dream deck here, you know, my dream setup, and uh, this is the piece that will completely finish it there. Very happy with those as well. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I'm so nice. Can we get some close up shots. Yeah, we will for sure. Oh, yeah. These are, wow, these are so good looking. Like, I, I ordered them both in street shape. That's my favorite shape for wheels. I don't know. I just, I like the, the way it looks like an actual skateboard wheel. And, um, like, it's like as if we, you actually took some Spitfires and just shrunk them down to the size for a fingerboard. These are crazy. I, I don't know. I don't know what to say, they're just so clean looking. I'm very happy to have these here today. I didn't think they'd ever be coming, to be honest. Um, thank you so much to Basid from Elastico. I am, I'm at a loss for words at how clean these are. I think the only thing left to do is um, put, them put them on the decks. So let's do that. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. In, the, in the bag, they looking like that. Yeah, that looks so clean. Very nice. I'll, I'll a little. Yeah, it looks good. Oh yeah, there we go, there we go. Perfect. Okay. Here are the wheels. Wow. Just like no no imperfections in them. They're all almost identical. The swirls are also so particular. Like such small little black accents on it, but it looks so good. Yeah, I've never actually listened to you. It's like his most famous song. I've heard. Set up, boys. Pull my boy up to the camera. Finally done. And oh, oh my god. Yeah, there you go, there you go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can see, boys, that Ooh. looks very nice. Do, the kick do a kickflip test. test? Yeah, kick I was about to say, you have to do the kickflip <laughs> test. Hold on, when you focus it. Don't forget up. Oh my god. All right. So these wheels actually suck. Like, I fucking hate last. <laughs> are crazy, bro. Do a little squeak test. It's clean. <laughs> it's clean. Yes. These are very nice. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Except once you kind of go past 35, it's kind of just like. 